My name is Aksana Salamatina and we are at Salamatina Gallery. I um, get very excited and things that I truly believe. You know, I truly, truly believe. And to me the whole excitement is, uh, is to bring art to Long Island. Forty Six XX is really the perfect summer show. You have bodies drenched in water. You have classical nudes. You have playful busts. You have bathing suits, and it's really a celebration of women. Carol Furman is the master, I call her, you know, she is the master. And she is a very essential artist. If you noticed, her sculptures, most of them have their eyes closed. And when you come closer and you experience and look at the sculptures, you almost feel the pleasure that those uh, sculptures experience at the moment, they become alive. Um, they, they're happy, you know, and you feel happy standing next to that. And I think that that's what Carol is all about, to bring that sensuality in a sculpture. She actually does another body of work, which are her bronzes, and these are more organic, more tactile, more, um, there's more movement to them, and it's a technique which she herself developed. It's a very mature work for a young artist, especially working very unusual medium, collage. They are composed of everything from nudes cut out of postcards to fabric beads, sequins, butterflies, peacock feathers, anything that sort of exudes, I think, a strong sense of comfort with what a woman is and what a woman's world is all about. In the show we have her uh, finger paints, I call them. It's, uh, she takes the flesh paint and uh, smears that uh, on the color aid paper. It becomes very much about the woman transformation, about um, feeling, you know, what is that to be a woman. Lisa is an American who lives in Italy, and she went to an attic in Italy and found all sorts of olives net, olive nets, which were bedspreads sewn together. And the nets still had the stains from the olives on them, and she composes them into flags that are almost a cross between a painting and a sculpture, because she then paints the fabric with tar, and the tar represents oil and the fight for oil all over the world. It's a show that prompts a lot of responses. Everybody has a mother, everybody has a sister or a, a friend or a girlfriend or a lover or, and, and I think that the, the strength of the female gene and the strength of the female form is just something that it's a touchstone for everyone and it's a, it's a, it's a point of departure for so much in culture and in fashion. And so it's a wonderful coming together of all these elements to bring it here. <laughs>